Grab your trench coats, detectives, and don't forget your utility belt because we've got a mystery on our hands. Today, we're about to uncover some upcoming news that's as mysterious as the night in Gotham itself. It's a tale that'll have you questioning everything, folks. Merry Little Batman was all set to light up Cartoon Network in the 2023 holiday season, a festive caper that promised laughs and cheers. But as they say, nothing's ever what it seems in this town. Just when we thought we had the story all figured out, Amazon Studios, like a shadowy figure lurking in the night, swooped in and snagged Merry Little Batman for their prime video platform. It happened faster than a pickpocket making a clean getaway. And that, my friends, is just the beginning of this twisted yarn. In April of this year, we heard that Merry Little Batman had been tossed aside at HBO Max, like yesterday's news. It was almost lost in the dark, forgotten alleyways of showbiz. But Amazon, they played the hero. They not only saved our caped crusader, but also ordered a spin-off series they call Bat Family. And the story doesn't end there, folks. Sam Register, the bigwig, over at Warner Bros. Animation, promises a whole new chapter in the world of animated Batman tales. From the shadowy noir of Caped Crusader to the humor and enigma of Merry Little Batman and Bat Family, it's a new dawn for animated Batman stories that'll leave fans of all stripes intrigued. Hold on to your fedoras, because here's where the plot thickens. Picture this. A six-year-old Damian Wayne, alone in Wayne Manor, decides it's time to become Little Batman. His mission? To protect his home in Gotham City from the villains that want to snuff out the holiday spirit. But this ain't your grandma's Christmas tale, folks. In Gotham City, it's not all about carolers and candy canes. It's about criminals and supervillains out to rob Christmas of its shine. Can Little Batman save the day and bring some joy back to these grim streets? When it comes to Merry Little Batman, we're left wondering which villains might show up. We received a poster with the news released of the premiere date. In the dim light of this enigmatic holiday artwork, we find ourselves staring into the heart of Gotham's shadowed soul. It's a snow globe, a world trapped in an icy sphere, and our focus is drawn to two figures charging toward us. There, in the whirl of snowflakes, we see two caped crusaders, Batman and his diminutive sidekick, Little Batman, a formidable duo charging headlong towards the screen, their capes billowing like stormy clouds over Gotham. This is where we received our first clue as to who else may be appearing in this animated adventure. For in the ominous backdrop looms a figure shrouded in mystery. A shadowy presence, a long-haired figure whose sinister grin mirrors that of the Joker himself. But is it truly the Clown Prince of Crime? That, my friends, remains a riddle wrapped in an enigma that only time can give us the answer to. We've got a theory, detectives. One as murky as the waters of Gotham Harbor. You see, in this city, we know there's more than just the Joker lurking in the shadows this Christmas. What about the other villains? Those who've earned a top spot on both Santa's and Batman's naughty lists? Could it be Catwoman, the feline femme fatale, looking to snatch up all the shiny ornaments for her collection? What about Harley Quinn, the Joker's equally unpredictable partner in chaos? Her knack for mayhem could easily fit the bill. And let's not forget the Riddler, a mastermind when it comes to crafting cunning and enigmatic schemes he'd be right at home causing holiday havoc. With their ties to Damian Wayne, we wouldn't be surprised if the League of Assassins showed up to steal Damian's Christmas joy. It's a guessing game, a riddle within a riddle. You know, this might not sound like our usual cup of tea, the hard-nosed detective tales of the night, but this is the kind of show that some kid at just the right age will watch, and it'll become a yearly Christmas tradition for them. A spark of magic in their lives, keeping the spirit of the Dark Knight alive in the most unlikely of settings. It's not like we Bat fans don't already have a history of Christmas in Batman's world to enjoy. Christmas has played a part in different iterations of the Caped Crusader. Who can forget Batman Returns, where the snowy streets of Gotham set the stage for a dark and twisted holiday? Or those memorable Batman, the animated series episodes like Christmas with the Joker and Holiday Nights? Then there's The Long Halloween where Christmas was more than just decoration. It was a backdrop to the tale's intrigue in the final act of the first film. And how can we overlook the chilling Christmas Eve in the Batman video game, Arkham Origins? Even with all of these great pieces of media to enjoy, here's the thing, folks. We yearn for a day when DC delivers a dark and gritty Batman Christmas animated film, one that we adults can sink our teeth into, a noir masterpiece that captures the essence of the Dark Knight in all his complex glory. Until then, Merry Little Batman may be just the twinkle of hope we need to keep the bat signal shining. 
So, while we're left guessing at which villains will grace our screens in this holiday tale, one thing's for sure. We'll be sure to catch Merry Little Batman on December 8th, 2023, when it makes its debut on Amazon Prime Video. If this is the kind of content you like, you'll want to see some of the other videos I'm making. I'm trying to make this a full-time gig and post content every day, but I need your help to keep going. Hit that Batscribe button, as it really will help the channel. Until next time, detectives, always remember that Gotham's secrets are buried deep, and it's our duty to unearth them, one dark alley at a time.